Hello YouTubers, beer geeks and beer hounds alike. Bill here and we're going to do a beer review. This one is by Bells and it's called Lager of the Lakes. It's a Bohemian Pilsner and this is what the can looks like. It's got a, a date on the bottom packaged on May 5, 31, 19, and today is 7, 17, 19, so it's about a little over a month and a half old, and um, this one comes in at 5% ABV, and uh, yeah, Bell's Brewing. This is their lager. I got this at um, Total Wine as a single can for like two bucks. So uh, let's get it cracked open and see what we got here. That's a really cool looking can by the way. I mean if you really look at that. This is a sweet can. It's got all kinds of stuff to look at on it here. Uh, Yeah, 5% or lager, Pilsner. Same thing, I guess. Well, let's check it out. Let's check it out. I had their uh, Two Hearted Ale. No, I reviewed it not too long ago. It's their IPA or APA. It was really good. Totally yummy and really good beer. Good deal, too, like 10 bucks for a six pack of cans all right I, I've been kind of enjoying uh, Pilsner's a little bit lately lagers because of uh, the uh, Chihuahua lagers that I've had lately were really um, really tasty and different you know than IPA I mean I love IPAs but it's, it's nice to try other beers too you know as long as they're good um, I don't know if I'll ever get into sours. I've tried and tried and I just don't like them. But everything else I'm pretty game. Not so much Gulfs or the Flanders stuff or the Saisons. Not much into that. But everything else is pretty cool with me. But uh, my favorite are um, IPA stouts. You know the uh, American Pales. and Loggers are starting to make a little comeback here with me. Back when I used to drink uh, lagers, it was macro brewery stuff, so it really wasn't that good. Last train home. So, um, we got a monster frothy creamy head. Crystal clear. Uh, straw yellow color, or a really light gold color. Uh, got some bubbles streaming up in the bottom there, from the bottom. It's a very good looking beer. The head's just hanging around. Looks like it's probably a well, very well put together beer that we have here. Yeah, the head's going rocky. See the clarity of the beer? Very clear. All right. See the bubbles streaming up from the bottom. Head's going rocky. All right, well, let's get an aroma on this puppy. All right, right up front, it's got some kind of like a sweetness. Almost like a Kind of like a graininess, kind of uh, some kind of a grain. It's almost like a corn, like a cream of corn type smell. A little bit of kind of um, some kind of a veggie smell almost. Very interesting 
smelling, but for the most part, it smells kind of like uh, cream of corn, but kind of light. But yeah, it smells like corn, kind of. Well, that's what I get. Let's get a hit. Cheers. Look at that head, by the way. Really awesome. Mmm. That's really tasty. Very tasty. I like that. Uh, the taste follows the aroma uh, with a very slight, very slight kind of um, earthy kind of hop note. Very light though. Let's see if we can pick up something else. Mm, that's tasty. Yeah, that's what we got. It's not hoppy at all. It's a real easy drink. It's got medium to light mouthfeel. Kind of has a, you know, a little beery taste, you know, like a little bit of bread yeast, uh, a little corn flavor. No bad aftertaste. It's very tasty going down. Very refreshing. Let's uh, swill it and uh, we'll wrap it up. Cheers. Yeah, that's tasty. I would take this over any macro brewery, uh, Pilsner, any day of the week. This 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 is very nice tasting. Uh, it tastes like it's it's all grain. It doesn't taste like it has a, a adjunct fillers in it. It's leaving some nice uh, lacing on the glass there. Yeah, it's just like a corn, kind of a corn taste, which I like. Let's get another hit. Cheers. Look at that head. Creamy. That's delicious. All right, well, I'll have the rape beer description in the description section of the bottom of this video. And a scale of one to um, five stars. I'll give this puppy a 3.8 out of 5. And that's my story, and I'm sticking with it. All right, everybody, that's what we got. Bell's Lager of Lakes. It's a Bohemian Pilsner. Uh, 3.8 stars out of 5 for me. It's delicious. Um, I, would, I would pick this up in session with this. This is an excellent session beer. One more time, we'll wrap it up. Yeah, that's enjoyable. That's very tasty. That's a very tasty Pilsner. Um, I like it. It's 5%. You can session the crap out of it. 3.8 is what I give it. And you all take it easy. We'll catch you later. See ya.